What's up, y'all? It is your boy, Dre41, and uh, wanted to give just a little bit of a video um, of, uh, yeah, basically what I wanted to do for the summer. Um, so, yeah, this this is an update on my plans for the summer and uh, what I want to bring to the channel, um, what I want to do just, you know, in, in, in general, just the overall... I the grasp of what I am attempting so basically what I am attempting to do is to grow this channel by leaps and bounds um, I don't want it to just be a situation where I'm uploading WWE games content I mean that's that's the meat and potatoes of the channel but I also want to spread my wings and fly <laughs> I also want to be able to upload different games stuff I want to play like I don't know, games I'm going to be super trashing, like hockey and, you know, some PlayStation 2 games that I enjoyed playing when I was younger. I want to get back into that, doing reviews um, on different video games, things like that. Mostly wrestling, probably, uh, but, at you know, just, just stuff that's entertaining. Um, I want to do more uh, face cams. Right now, I can't even live stream on YouTube. Uh, that's my fault. <laughs> so, um, I don't know. For the next couple of months, I won't be able to live stream on YouTube. Which is a bit of an issue. But, um, it, it's fine. It's fine. I'll, I'll be okay. And uh, once they lift the suspension, I'm back at it. And I will be uh, live streaming again. But, you know, until then, it is what it is. I can't really stress it. Um, but, yeah. I mean, it's, it's, it's just a situation where it's like I could create a wrestler. I can do a video on how I did it. But eventually, it kind of gets to the point where it's like, okay, you know, um, that's about it. You know, people, people get bored of it. Especially if you're creating the same call every single year you kind of run out of like videos like how many times i'm going to do a creation corner on kenny omega or cody rhodes or the young bucks or the great muda or hayabusa or something like that so it it kind of gets to a point where you know yes i, I like doing the uh, packs that that's easier for me because people get to choose what i make i don't know if i'm going to do it for 2k20 I'm kind of like I'm 10 years in creating calls and uploading them. Um, I don't know if that's going to be something that I continue to do in 2K20 where I take um, requests. It, it might be here and there, but then again, it might just be something that um, I'm going to make. Um, I'm just going to make, you know, certain calls. I'm not going to go crazy. I'm not going to go wild on the the creating aspect i want to play games with other people do live streams while i do that it, it's a lot of different things that i really want to do um playing um you know just just playing games and and live streaming you know i downloaded a bunch of old school games that i really want to get out um i have three count bout i hope you guys really like that i hope you guys want to view that video and see me just fumble my way through that game if you guys want to see a full playthrough of something let me know um like i said i, I don't want it to just be uh be a one-trick pony i want to be able to put out content where you know you guys are entertained basically off of what i'm playing whether i'm winning or losing it doesn't even matter just as long as you guys are entertained uh by what i do I mean, even right now, as I'm speaking, you know, you're seeing footage from uh, WWE 2K19 um, that I put in the background, you know. But I also have, um, I have golf. Um, I have a, a PGA game. Um, I want to be able to put that on the channel. I'm not too sure how that would do because golf is not everyone's sport. Hell, it's not even my type of sport. But for some odd, it's maybe because I actually played it in real life um, that I enjoy it. But um, at the same time, it's just a situation where I don't know how many people will enjoy it. You know, 
So it, it all boils down to just me making sure that whatever I put on this channel is entertaining to you guys. I don't never want it to be stale or boring or something you guys don't want to see or you're like, oh, okay. Like for the summer, the one thing that I do have um, every Tuesday will be an AEW universe. Um, like a throwback Thursday I want to do as well. I want to do that like a throwback Thursday maybe. Um... Uh, do like some old school gaming or something like that and try to get my way through it. Um, I also have Metal Slug, like the complete series. I can go through that as well. And, you know, that could be something within itself. Um, just a lot of different things. I, I want to really grow this channel. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm in, I am on the move to getting 3,000 subscribers. I want to get 3,000 subscribers by the summer. I don't know if it's possible. I'm not that far from it, but I would love to be able to get 3,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. It would be really cool um, if I was able to do that. If you know, if I get enough subscribers, you know, and then get to 3,500 and 4,000 and 5,000, you know, six, seven. You know what I'm saying? Just grow and grow and grow. I really want this channel to to become an entertainment avenue. For anybody who wants to just go on YouTube and hear somebody speak or talk trash or whatever, you know, because a lot, I think a lot of people hear me um, play video games and not even some video games, wrestling, and they're used to hearing a certain tone or, you know, me acting a particular way because I got to do commentating. But and that's not how I sound when I'm playing other games. Um, just like if I'm playing NBA or, or football game, not soccer, American football. <laughs> um, if I'm playing that, like I'm trash talking and, you know, I sound a lot different. Uh, it's just a lot of things that I want to do to really grow this channel. And I feel like I can do that. Um, you know, I just want to make sure that you guys are entertained by what I upload. You know what I'm saying? I, I really want to make sure that you guys are. Um, so yeah, that's that's really about it. I didn't really want to go too crazy into you know going into full detail and everything like that. But uh, that's about it for what I have to say in regards to what I plan on doing this summer. Um, not really much else to say. So what I'll do is I'll just leave this match going the way it is, and I'll uh, be quiet, and you guys get to watch this match. But uh, other than that, like, subscribe, comment. Thank you guys for watching. Catch you in the next video later. He's in a little bit of trouble now. He's definitely starting to feel the pressure of this fatal four-way match, guys. I'm really disappointed in what we're seeing from him here tonight. Heading in. I really thought he had a chance of winning this fatal four-way match. This could end it in a hurry. Doesn't appear to be locked in very well. This might be it. Oh, great job breaking the hold there. Good thing, too. That could have been ugly, Michael. Ooh. Look out here. He's looking at it. He caught him slipping. He looks for it once again. Beautiful technique. Can he finish the job? No question, he's feeling invincible right now. Oh boy, he is rolling. He might have it. Side slam. This one is over. He gets the shoulder up in time. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? He's too quick for him there. This, he can take. this is an incredibly bad spot for him to be in here in this four-way match. Dodges a bullet there. Nailed it. We're going to see it. Way up there. You've got to believe this one's over. Game, set, match. Shoulders down. This could be it. When this guy's on, look out. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Just a step quicker, it looks like. That's using your head. 
There he goes, crashing to the floor. Wow, I thought he was a goner. Reverses that one. Going for it all here. Close impact. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guy. Look at this. One, two, three. That's been eliminated. Oh, distance there. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Boom, what impact! Boom! This one's still going on, especially after the beating that's been delivered tonight. Here he goes. He looks to be losing a bit of leverage here. He breaks it. I can't believe it. I can't believe I'm going to say this, but I'm with you, Cole. So unbelievable that he broke out of that. Oh, my goodness. What an impactful STO. He wants no part of the outside. He's not going to like this. And now one more time. What's going to happen now? He's in full control now. Watch out here. Unceremoniously deposited down. Axe handle finds its target. Looking for all the glory here. Two. Oh, that was a close call. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. His opponent included. Putting it all on the line. Caught off guard. 
Incoming. Back now inside the ring. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. He might have it. You gotta believe this one's over. But he's gotta capitalize now. Two, three. The cover, and this one's history. What a win. And here's another peek at some of the more memorable parts of the match. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. Almost forgot about this one. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. And I always enjoy watching him perform. Here is your winner, Dawn. And he gets the job done here tonight. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count. And that's yet another great match the city of Baltimore has hosted over there.